Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala chooses for us certain things. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the one who gives and he is the one who can prevent someone from receiving. So everything is from Allah. When Allah gave prophethood, he chose those whom he intended to give prophethood very carefully with the best amongst them being Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And we need to know that from among the people, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had chosen them to go through test upon test. If you think that you have had issues in your life or you have had problems or difficulty or calamity or hardship in your life, you need to simply go through the lives of those whom Allah chose being higher than you and I in rank. And those are the prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah's peace and blessings be upon them. Remember, the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, the prophets of Allah are the ones who are tested the most. And after that, those who are closest to them, and then those who are closer and so on. So if you're having a lot of challenges, but you're a believer, trust me, it's a good sign. In Allah, إِذَا أَحَبَّ عَبْدًا ابْتَلَاهُ When Allah loves his slave, he tests him. It's supposed to bring you closer to Allah. It's supposed to bring you closer in a way that your heart is softened. You become a better person. You become more conscious of your obligations. And you become a person who knows, subhanallah, that I'm supposed to be abstaining from sin. And whenever, wherever I falter, I should be seeking the forgiveness of Allah with hope in the mercy of Allah.